Harry in through for the single, Bottles have to move but makes it. And the single from Greg at long last brings the three figures up for England. 100 for four. So a chance for Wayne Daniel to come down the slope here at Headingley from the Kirkstall Lane end. And gloriously driven through the offside. Not a particularly quick delivery that, it was a little bit of a loosener, wasn't quite a half volley in fact. Uh, but there was a big wide open space there which Greg found very confidently indeed. Hitting it on the up, in the air, but perfectly safe, there's no mid-off there. So Daniel to come in and bowl to Bolderston. That's a good shot, half volley, it was a no ball too, clipped off his legs. Julian given chase, slowing down, might just stop it. Little back heel to Andy Roberts to complete the fielding. Isn't the same fluency, of course, about his approach to the wicket as one sees with holding on with Roberts. He's a big powerful man. This is where he starts to strain a little bit. And that's a fine shot. Lloyd giving chase. If anybody can catch it, he will. Now it's beaten them both. So the four that Tony Gregg wanted, the hat already off. A claiming fine ovation from this crowd here at Headingley, going through to his first 50 in this Test Series. Couldn't really have come at a better time for him. Came in when England was struggling at eight of a four, now shared a 69 partnership with Balderston, and he's made 50. He's turned away on the leg side. Two runs here to Chris Balderson. 